Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, state design pattern real time example. Uh, before you watch this video tutorial, please log into my channel and watch uh, state design pattern introduction video tutorial. Then come and watch this tutorial so that you will understand this tutorial very clearly. Okay. Uh, now we will see the real time example of uh, state design pattern. Uh, suppose say I want to develop a uh, web application project. Uh, so the initially the internal state of the project will be the uh, requirement uh, engineering. So in the requirement engineering phase what we can do is we can gather requirements from the client. But we can't do testing or uh, development or support. Okay. Uh, so once the requirement uh, uh, gathering is uh, done uh, then the state of the project will be moved to uh, design and architecture phase. So in the design and architecture uh, phase what we can do is uh, uh, we can uh, uh, design the project uh, meaning we can do a class diagram sequence diagram and we can decide what kind of uh, technology we are planning to use in order to develop the application so that kind of uh, work we can do it in the design and the architecture uh, phase okay so once this state is uh, finished then it will be moved to uh, development state okay so now uh, the publication project state is uh, development uh, phase okay so in development phase what we can do is we can do coding we can do unit testing so all those work we can do but we can't do support or maintenance or requirement gathering in this uh, state okay so once uh, development work is uh, finished then the internal state will be moved to testing uh, state so now uh, project uh, state is uh, testing state so in uh, testing state what we can do is we can uh, do the manual testing or automation testing so all those uh, testing uh, we can do and we can make sure uh, the project uh, is okay and doesn't have any bugs okay so once uh, testing phase is uh, over uh, then the state will be moved to maintenance uh, state so in maintenance state what we can do is we can maintain the project so once uh, maintenance state is uh, finished uh, then the internal state of the project will be moved to support uh, phase okay uh, so once uh, support phase is uh, over uh, we can uh, again do the requirement gathering for the next set of uh, work uh, maybe enhancement of the project okay so this is how uh, uh, the state is moved from uh, one state to another state uh, of the uh, particular web application project so this is a very good example of uh, state design pattern okay uh, this is about uh, state design pattern real time example and i have created a separate video tutorials for uh, state design pattern class diagram and uh, state design pattern implementation if you want to know more about this uh, design pattern please log into my channel and uh, watch those videos and thanks for watching bye